was a great privilege for us to get involved with the ESCOM guys. What they actually have done is they gave us an opportunity to get out of our mess downstairs and to took one step up. Okay? But this ability took us further up, the ability to look inward into ourselves, who we are, but most of all, number one, to get our management system right. Ne? Number two, besides our management system, to get a broader understanding of the organizational structure, who we are, but most of all, number three, the ability to stand upon the giant. And those guys of Ukufana, they were actually giants. And for those few months that they were here, we, they, we stood upon giants, and the giants we stood upon gave us the vision to look further, ne? a new direction. Thank you very much, Ukufana. Thank you very much, ESCO. Great. Okay, um, I'd like to thank the Ugufana team from ESCOM for the good work that they've done in this organization, uh, the relationship that they have established with us, the way they supported us through the journey that we undertook with them. It was a long journey, it was a process, it was a learning curve for us, and I think they have helped us to develop a lot of things. We have gained so much from them, especially coming from a corporate uh, sector and we being in the NGO sector, it was nice to hear how we can also try to tweak in our uh, core business to, 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 to benefit our community. So I'd like to say thank you guys. Yeah, I would just love to thank the Ugufana team. When we heard about this intervention, I was also skeptical because of all the intervention and the workload that we were exposed to. But then when the team came in, I was pretty much impressed. We appeared the same. The team was willing to understand what we are going through. They were willing to work with us. And what really inspired me was the passion for, from Ugufana team. These people were actually willing to work with us every distance. They took us from the bottom and they worked with us through the steps. We might have not reached the end yet, but at least now we've got the clear vision of where we are going. And I really, really would love to thank the Ugufana team for their, co their, for their commitment. And I could see the passion in them because at times I could feel that they would take even their personal time to make sure that the well-being of the team and the functionality of Outreach Foundation is taken care of. So I truly and truly like to thank the Okufana team, the Henley Business School for the initiative and the ESCO team as a whole for all they've done for us. Now the vision is clear. At least we have we managed to work on other things that we were struggling with in the past. Thank you very much Okufana. Well, I just want to say thank you to Eskom and the Handley Business School. Uh, when Thomas first approached us with the proposal, we had been through many processes and I think we were feeling a little bit fatigued by the processes and that we hadn't quite implemented. And so we were feeling a little bit skeptical about entering a new process. Um, so the first session with Eskom was kind of, I suppose, testing the ground, testing each other. Um, but I think very quickly a trust evolved. And what has been extraordinary is what we've achieved in the last six months with Eskom. And since I've been here, which is just over six years, we really have been struggling as an organization to, to kind of deal with issues around governance, We've had quite a lot of internal conflict. We've had issues around roles and responsibilities and trying to understand the, the structures, um, the management structures. And I think Eskom allowed us through quite a few sessions to really speak honestly, to really kind of, yeah, it was almost like there was that magical third person in the room that allowed us to really interact on a deeper level with each other uh, and with Eskom to, to get Eskom to really try and understand some of the comp complexities of the environment we work in. 
Um, and so it feels like a huge achievement that we've created frameworks, documents that kind of define how we work now. And now it's really up to us as the EXCO, as executive director, to, to implement, to work within those structures and to find a way forward for the organization. Um, yeah, but there were added things. Um, Alex coming around and checking out all the buildings and, and being quite strict with us about being compliant in terms of safety regulations um, and Avon really sort of becoming a consultant for the board and already just offering his valuable time um, giving advice um, so I think this is a relationship that will continue and I just want to say really thank you um, for taking the journey with us and for really promising a continued journey. Thank you. I would like to say thank you very much to the Gufana team. They have helped us a lot. They travel with us for six months through our journey. We learned a lot from them. They help us to put the structures in place. They even advise us to solve our problems. We cannot hesitate to welcome them back at any time. Viva Ufana Viva!